So this is uh, Buell Street, um, Tesco, Hereford. Much of a muchness with every single uh, city. Incidentally, this is the place where PC Lee Phillips of Hereford Police uh, arrested uh, a chap for not wearing a mask. And the police officer was led completely by um, Tesco staff instead of his own sergeant, which I think I thought was really bad. Um, I think it was a time where everybody um, was vaccinated and this guy, an elderly guy, was stood right here and uh, he was still completely uh, uh, detained and arrested uh, for not wearing a mask. Um, and he was an elderly gentleman and the police arrested him just there and they they manhandled him later on uh, Hereford police uh, for not wearing a mask and he was in his 90s um, he tried to explain to the police he tried to explain to the police that uh, he had had his uh, vaccinations but absolutely they didn't take care any notice and uh, they wouldn't allow him to record um, and it was right here where it happened and uh, it's just a shocking indictment at the moment of Hereford Police where they do not absolutely care what age you are they will throw you in the back of the van and uh, deal with you so that, this is where it happened anyway just here and uh, if you type in Hereford Police um, you will uh, you'll find it and the officer is called PC Lee Phillips and he actually called for a van at the same time um, to put this guy in and as you'll see it was quite a hot day as well um, and they obviously didn't give a damn about this guy they just wanted to get the, the tickets in um, get the money for a corrupt government and I wonder if that guy ever had a ticket his money refunded because um, Boris Johnson had all those famous parties didn't he So if uh, Boris Johnson committed illegal acts whilst he was meant to be isolating, doesn't that mean the whole of Hereford should have their uh, COVID-19 tickets rescinded and uh, refunded? Yeah, just, uh, just some thoughts there as to, what, as to what's going on. Um, so yeah, this is Buell Street. Most of these places have been done for illegal cigarette selling. But, uh, yeah, Hereford police are more, uh, more interested in sort of picking on the vulnerable. So, we'll see how it goes. Again, we're at the other side of the town now. And uh, there's absolutely no police at all. Yeah, so even if I call it a nation, 